just finished testing the StarCraft Starfish 236. It's powered by the Mercury 115 four-stroke. With this package, we've got really great performance. This boat has twin 25-inch tubes, which are a little bigger than normal, so we get really good buoyancy. We got on plane in 2.8 seconds and 20 miles an hour in 5.6 seconds with a top speed of 30 miles an hour, you know, which is fast enough to get you ski in. And this, this boat is hydraulic steering, so the steering is very easy. We're able to turn it around and turn, so if you're tubing, you know, you can whip the kids around and have a lot of fun. But if you're really serious about water sports, I would suggest going with the uh, 150 Max uh, horsepower engine. That way you won't be taxing your engine at high o RPM all the time. But plus, if you're, we have a fishing package at back, you know, anxious to get to the fish, you can get there a lot quicker. Let's take a look at some of the features of this boat. Well, I'll tell you what, if you thought you've seen the StarCraft Starfish 236 before, you wouldn't recognize it now. For 2012, they made some incredible uh, improvements on this boat, inside and outside. Outside, you have all new derails and styling, so it looks totally different. And inside, we have the new uh, dielectric uh, seating uh, vinyl here, the really comfortable. You got the bolster support for your thighs, just a very comfortable look. And one good feature about these uh, storage compartments is they have a rain gutter that drains outboard. So uh, if rain does get in here, it doesn't stay down there. It's a really nice feature. Really good storage in this boat. I'll tell you other improvements we've made at the helm. Let's take a look. Well, I'll tell you what, this console is all new for 2012. It's a wraparound uh, model, and this Brolwood is new, and we have a table that matches it as well, which is really good looking. It gives it a really rich feel. Our, our boat is equipped with the optional Humminbird colored GPS fish finder. I'll tell you what, if you're serious about your fish, fishing or cruising, you're going to want to have that. And we have the also the up, upgraded JBL stereo here. So it's a very comfortable, got your tilt steering, just a great place to sit. I'll tell you what, on my days off, this is my office. I love to fish, and the 236 Starfish is all set. Check out these really stylish uh, uh, molded seats here, and they're really comfortable. This baby right here is a great fillet. It's made out of starboard, so you can cut on it. You don't have to worry about marring the finish. It's got four vertical rod holders, chrome bezeled cup holders. And what's nice is, you know, if you're shifting into entertainment mode, this is a great hors d'oeuvre table, too. Now in the back, we have the optional ski toe. And if you'll notice, it's double braced, and it's just rock solid. In a boat like this, you want to be able to do everything uh, on water that you could possibly jam in there. In the back, we have a swimming pool style uh, style ladder, and it's uh, really easy to get out when you're done skiing. For more information on the StarCraft Starfish 236 and other great boats, go to BoatingWorld.com. I'm Alan Jones, and we'll see you out on the water.